What's up, everybody? Back here. Still dealing with the fucking ants. Don't know where the fuck they are. Don't want to know where they are. It's my shotgun. I need shoddy. Okay, that time I wasn't so scared. Okay, I think I think I'm a little better about it now. It's not as scary. I still don't like bugs though. Um I need my flashlight. Grady. 50 caliber round, lunchbox. Dinky little pistol, no wonder you died. Well, I guess let's listen to that note. If you're listening to this tape, then my brains are splattered all over a wall somewhere. And you've got a job to do. You need to retrieve the package and get it safely to Ronald Lauren and Gerner Shade. Tell him Grady sent you. To get the package, you'll need the key. I've stashed it inside an old fire hose case in some maintenance closet in Marigold Metro Station. The key will unlock the safe that contains the package. Look for the room marked by a spinning light. You can't miss it. Good luck. And hopefully, they won't find you too. A spinning light? Deliver some package? Um, interesting. I certainly can't go that way. I think this weapon's best for what we're dealing with. However, as for everything else, I have no idea which way to go. Oh, thank God that didn't hurt. Okay, it's just rebar. Yeah, come on, buddy. Shoot him in the head. Ooh, I have good aim. Yeah, he's going down. He didn't stand a chance. Didn't even get close. Back up. He's angry. Ooh. Die. You don't deserve to live. Oh, thank God I crippled his friggin' leg. Okay, we're clear. You skittering around, you little shit. Come on out, I don't want to fire my bullets in there. I can clearly see that's a gas leak room. That be a fucking warrior.
that be the real definition of terror. I'm a fucking pussy. Let's get rid of this. There we go. So I'd rather not deal with it later. Alright. Now would probably be a good time to heal. Oh, I had a big book of science. Nice. I hear that. Yeah, you go fucking burn in hell. You bastard. I now know those blow up. Guns blazing! Suppressive fire! Take one of those. Okay. Is there anything of any use in here? I can't guarantee we'll find that dude's package, but oh well. second I thought you would want to talk to me. Well, you startled me. <laughs> you startled you me. Creep up on people like that. Sorry, I didn't expect to bump into you when I'm down here. That is precisely why this is the ideal place for my work. Do you realize you're trampling about in a delicately balanced and highly sensitive experimentation area? Experiments? My what you experiments mean? experiments are of a complex nature and would take a scientist to explain. Oh wait! I'm a scientist! How marvelous! My foray into reducing the girth of these insectoid creatures is of utmost importance. I intend to generationally reduce their immense stature by way of a pre-birth induced mutagen. Isn't that clever? Ah! So you're trying to make them small over time by injecting the eggs. My word, you understand perfectly. How marvelous. So what went wrong? Well, I'm afraid I made slight miscalculations in the mutagen. Instead of lowering their size, the brood hatched with a new biomechanism. I call their genetic aberration pyrosis, the ability to emit flame from their bodies. I may be able to correct this error, but, but I can't get near my equipment. I'm shocked you didn't attempt this in a controlled environment first, yeah. Your knowledge of experimental procedure surprises me. Indeed, I have skipped a step and directly modified an entire brood. Perhaps I was too hasty. 
I was so certain it would work. To correct this mistake, I'll need to get to my terminal to modify the mutagen. So, how can I help? Since you've offered, allow me to elaborate. My portable terminal is set up in the hatchery chamber near the Ant Queen. If I can reach it, I can continue to work on improving the mutagen. So... If she were harmed in any way, months of data would be lost. Your objective would be to eliminate what I call her quintet of nest guardians. Filthy little abominations. And this will undo the mayhem how? I've rigged the equipment at my portable terminal to emit what I call an inhibitor pulse. Once I send this pulse, all of the remaining ants will lose their empathic link with the queen and frenzy destroying each other in the process. So that's all there is to it. What do you say? Um, if it'll help stop this shit, yeah. It will? How marvelous. You like the word marvelous, don't Careful, you? my friend. The nest guardians can be quite tenacious. Please don't insult my in now. Oh, I was like, why is they even giving me the option to answer like that? Oh, sweet. I can take your ammo and this and this and this. And maybe some of that. And that. How else may I assist you in your endeavor? You're good. I just need all this ant meat. Oh, come on. Is this the only ammo you have? Come on, bro. Pork and beans. Cram. What's in here? Oh, this is the way to the dance nest. What was I going to do? Hmm. I forget. I do know I need to kill some shit, though. Jeez. Might just save that for the next episode. Yeah, we're going to save it for the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like it, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode. Till then, this is Flare Eternal, sign off.